morning, morning SHS, SHS and welcome, welcome back. back. My name is Blake Cater. I'm Ella True. And I'm Ella Hopkins. And will everybody please rise for a moment of silence. And now Blake will lead us in the pledges. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible with liberty and justice for all. Honor the Texas flag. I pledge allegiance to the Texas, one state under God, one and indivisible. All right, for the weather to start this week off, it is just about the same as last week. Temperatures will hover in the low 90s with the possibility, again, of large amounts of much needed rain through next week. Yeah, we are in some pretty desperate need for rain right now, but we're also needing some blood donors. If you're interested in, in saving up to three lives, you can become an SHS blood donor. The first blood drive of the year is going to be Thursday, September 8th, and you can talk to Ms. Lemos in the library for more information. We're needing a lot of things today. Student Council also needs freshman class representation and is now accepting self-nominations for class officer positions. If you are interested, please first stop by to speak with Ms. Garcia in room 27. Nominations will close tomorrow, so make sure you go ahead and go speak with her already. And Student Council will hold class meetings this week during advisory in the cafeteria. We are currently taking self-nominations for class officers and will have all candidates introduce themselves slash campaign for themselves during their class meeting. The schedule is as follows. Tuesday, August 30th will be sophomores. Wednesday, August 31st will be freshmen. Thursday, September 1st will be juniors. And Friday, September 2nd will be seniors. We will call the class when we are ready. So please first go check in with your advisory teacher and then we will call you out of class. Yes, and Fellowship of Christian Athletes, or FCA, will hold weekly meetings each Friday morning at 7.30 in Coach Lonnie's room. Everybody is welcome, not just the athletes. Speaking of athletes, Varsity Volleyball hosts Three Rivers tomorrow, and Sinton hosts their JV and Freshman Tournament Thursday and Saturday. And Varsity hosts Santa Gertrudis on Friday at 4.30. So be there, there will be good games. Go and support our Lady Pirates. Our cross country runs at Robin Bessie Walter Park Saturday morning, and our JV football travels to Rockport Thursday, September 1st with a 7 p.m. game while our Varsity Pirates host their first home game Friday at 7.30 against the Rockport Pirates. Be a good don't, don't put the before that. <laughs> well, Just Rockport. Rockport. Pirates. Rockport. Yeah, I have full confidence that our boys are going to wear the W, but I want to see all of y'all wearing y'all's costumes because we're having dress up days every game day. Uh, students and staff are encouraged to participate. And staff. And staff, but especially students. But especially students, yes. Um, so September 2nd is Dreaming of a Victory, Pajama Day. September 9th is Throwback the Sand Crabs, Decades Day. September 16th, The Pirates are Super, Marvel versus DC. September 23rd, Outshine the Bears, Neon. September 30th, Homecoming, Maroon Out. October 14th, Pink Out. And October 28th, To Victory and Beyond. So that is Disney Day. We're excited to see all the costumes that y'all have. We'll be wearing our costumes, oh, yeah. but we will have to switch up our costumes for a little bit for tuxedos and dresses, because we have senior portraits coming up. They're not dresses. Um, They're shirts. Tuxedos and shirts. <laughs> Blouses. You just said shirts. Okay, well. Senior portrait order is posted in front of Miss Roach's room and on the office window. Please make sure that your name is listed. If it's not, please let Miss Roach know. Photos are going to be August 31st and September 1st. All young men need to be clean shaven. It is recommended to wear an undershirt that you don't mind being seen in. Strawbridge provides all clothing needed for the actual photos. You need to make sure your hair, nails, makeup, and or jewelry is how you want to be removed. We all need to make sure we are dressed up again for fall portraits for all grades that's going to be on September 6th. We will use those pictures for the yearbook as well as your student ID. And if you happen to miss senior portraits or fall portraits, October 18th is going to be senior retakes and October 19th is going to be fall absentee. No trivia today, Blake? No trivia, unfortunately. We'll let our brains rest on this Monday. But we do have the results of another one of our polls. This is from the poll that we conducted on Friday. So the poll was to pick between Good and Crisp and Canes. There's a clear winner. Yeah, there is a very clear winner by just exactly double. Good and Crisp won 
over oh, yeah. Canes with a 28 to 14 victory. So I as mean, should. have to stay true to the Sneaky. local businesses. And as always, we will go ahead and end things off with the thought of the day. Today's thought of the day is a German proverb. Fear makes the wolf bigger than he is. Yeah. Like, Ella, would you care to expand? I think like, yeah. yeah, like does. So I think one of the biggest ways to combat fear is through confidence. And so if you have confidence in what you do, there's nothing to be afraid of. And it's really, it, you're like able to figure out that there's nothing in life that can get the best of you. Very good, good elaboration today. Good job. Keep that in mind today and throughout the rest of the week. We hope you all have an amazing Monday and amazing rest of your week. And we will see you back tomorrow. As go always, Pirates. go Pirates. Pirates.